Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Dot Hack Mutation. I'm your host Philly Fox and we're going to do a couple of things, a couple more things before we complete the game. Hooray! First of all, I'm going to grab a party because everything's better with a party, I guess. I don't know. I use Black Rose and Gardenia for a lot of things off screen, so I'm probably not going to use them right now. I don't need to. So, why don't we go ahead and grab uh, Sandro? Because he's rather cool. And, uh... Moonstone. I haven't used him for a long... Nah, not Moonstone. We have the same weapon. I don't like using people with the same weaponry. That's why you... I am a drug person. I didn't want to do that. Something that you... What? Need me after all? Something I never really noted is uh, if you dismiss someone and then add them to your party, like, right away, uh, generally you they have something special they say. So, who should I bring? No, I don't want to bring Pyros. I don't like using him at all. So, you know what? Let's take Nuke. We'll have the exact same party we would have normally. You want to play with me, huh? Yeah, sure. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go to a specific keyword. By the way, real quick, if you want to know the uh, uh, areas that I hunted for these swords, these weapons are, basically these. Anything that was uh, level 50, let's see, I went to this one, this one, this one, this one, this one didn't, this, this one didn't give me crap. This one got, had a lot of house, uh, house golems. Feck, I hate those, but that's the best place to get them. This one, and that one. That one was where I found the freaking great worm, or worm kings. No, that's where I found the worm kings, was this one. It was the last thing I needed, that's why I know. Now, so, I'm going to have to go to a, pl a couple places. Remember, we went to Capacious Unending Corridor a long time ago to get the um, Gemini Soul and Chinese food. This time, we're going to go to Bottomless... Or... This time we're gonna go to. Uh, where is it? Eh, I passed it. I don't know where it is! It was on the bottom, dang nabbit. Bottomless Soul Kaleidoscope, that's right. That's what I'm trying to say, but I can't seem to say it. It's all the way at the bottom, too. There is it. And Kaleidoscope. Na, 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 na. Kaleidoscope. This has a um, rather interesting item here. It's, uh, not, it's definitely not, rec or not, I almost said did not recommend it. It's recommended. It's not, uh, super important, but it's pretty neat. And there's a Spring of the Mist. Sorry, I was listening to the music there for a second. It's a little different at night. I like this one. Well, not this one, but... Uh, <laughs> I'm stuck! Come on. Okay, so... Whatever the case, we're gonna go directly to the dungeon, because I have completed the books on for this volume while I was doing the grinding. It takes a lot to uh, complete some of them, you know? The monster one, you'll gen generally do normally just by doing any grinding at all, so it's not really that big thing. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you the uh, dungeon map, and I'm not going to clear this dungeon out, so I'm going to meet you at the down. See you there. That was really easy. I could clear this out without with my eyes closed, really. Especially after I put on uh, uh, some uh, enhancements there. Let's see what they've got here. Uh, we've got another down, so I'll meet you guys there. Temple Knights ain't so hard now. <laughs> you know, this would have been a lot better to do a lot earlier, and I did mean to, I will admit. Uh, but um, I just really didn't really have the time. There it is. Or really give myself time to do it. So, let's see. We Oh, I forgot to use the Silver Grunty. This item, the BL Yoko, Yoko, Yokohama, Raises our water element by three. Which, uh, in other words, the uh, guide I was using is a liar! It said four, so they're stupid. They're stupid heads. Now I'm going to go ahead and meet you back in Londa for the next keyword. 
See you then. Uh, come. See you then. Come on. There we go. Wow. All right. So we're back now. Awesome. Uh, we're gonna go to another keyword right away now. And this one, interestingly enough, the last one was found on the Dot Hack Sign DVD set number two on the back of it. I don't have it personally, but the guide that I'm using tells me so. Now this one was found actually in a Japanese magazine. So we in the States here or anywhere outside of Japan, never, we'd have no way of figuring out how to, or finding this out. This is really annoying. There it is, lightless. Sacred, not cabbage, remains. There we go. 47. This one might be a tad tough. But yeah, this was a, this was in a, a Japanese... No, it was Japanese manga. I'm sorry. Not magazine. Where did I get magazine? Hey, it's a... Uh, we're in a forest. We got an axe I'm never going to use. So unfortunately, I actually have little... Ch wow, I have no choice but to clear this place out. So I'm going to go ahead and get everybody strengthened up, and, uh, I'll meet you up. I'll, you know, I'll probably just show it. Show my way through. There's no reason not to. There you can see how the, uh, Strengthening system works really well in this game. They just strengthen everybody. It's always the closest person, though. Alrighty. Yay! We got another box axe I don't want. I wonder if I'll run into some piney apples. I really hope so. There should be an enemy here. It's just one of those rooms. No piney apples, huh? All right, these arc princes are very annoying. Oh, snap you! As always, I hate these menors because they're really, really annoying. Akatsuki has some dark attack I'm gonna use on him. Dark dance. Now, I believe the arc prince can actually revive just like the menor can, which is why I hate them a lot as well. So, now that that's over, we're going to go right to the dungeon, because it's right here. I guess you could use this as a way to up your, or increase your field completion uh, it, or stuff requirements. Alright, now, like usual, I forgot to uh, turn on my timer. So I'm going to go ahead and clear off this floor, and then, or not clear out this floor, but meet you at the down. So I'll see you then. I have confirmed that the Arc Princes re have reviving abilities. Except, so, not only are they annoying like the Minor, but they have a much worse attack with a life drain and I think a death effect. So, meet you at the down again. Jeez, I just never seem to run out of SP. Seriously, I've been healing and using skills every single battle. They seem to run out of SP pretty quick, but I don't. Alright, I think right up the middle is the GOT statue. I may be wrong. This may be four floors. Who knows? Alright, I was right. It was right on the end of this floor. And we get the bent glasses. The last special equipment we can find in this game, to my knowledge. Bent glasses are a level 18 rare headgear, and they give you a poison ability and magic down ability. They are relatively worthless, in my opinion. They, uh... At least the uh, ceramic helm in the last game gave you rig steam and rig game. I suppose these would be really good on a wave master, but because I never give away rare equipment unless I can get multiples, it's going to go to waste. So that's all I'm going to do for this episode. Next episode, we're going to go ahead and start directly on the... Uh, whoops. I'm start directly into the final dungeon or area, or whatnot, or story area. I don't know what it is, but we're definitely going to do it. I will see you guys next time. Later.